guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Rachel J, and this is The Dollhouse. And for today, I'm going to be starting Mellow Mondays. And basically, Mellow Mondays, I'm going to be doing more personal videos with you guys. Um, like just videos so y'all can get to know me or probably a vlog or just more personalized videos. I'm doing the get to know me tag today. So y'all, I'll just be answering these questions and y'all get to know me a lot better. Just what I like, what I don't like, and my personality and yeah. Just to let you guys know, the giveaway is closed. I announced the winner on the comment section of that video. Congratulations, Sarah. And thank you guys so much for participating in that. I did tell you guys that when I reach 200 subscribers, I'll be doing another giveaway. And if you looked at my little subscriber count, I'm a little bit over 200. So I'm definitely going to be doing a giveaway very, very soon. So look out for the video on that. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. So let's get right into this video. Uh, the first question is, what is my middle name? My middle name is Elizabeth. Um, yeah, my middle name is Elizabeth. Number two, what is your favorite color? Hmm. I don't really have a favorite color, y'all. Like, I don't know. I guess I would say I'm starting to really love pink. Like, I would have never thought I would have said that years ago because I hated pink. Like, I hated pink. Anything pink, I just didn't like. But I'm really starting to like pink. I don't know. I like pink. I guess I would consider that my favorite color. Number three, who is my best friend? I don't really have a best friend, y'all. I have a couple of like friends, fr like you know, friends, but like I don't really have a best friend, I guess. Like, I'm lame. How tall are you? Um, I'm 5'2. Well, the last time I checked, I'm 5'2. I honestly always say 5'2 and a half because I'm pretty sure since the last time I got measured that I'm a little bit taller. So I'm gonna say 5'2 and a half. Um, number five, cats or dogs? Dogs. Dylan, come here. Funniest moment throughout school. Like, just my clumsiness is really what was like my funniest moments through school. How many countries have you visited? If you would count Mexico, <laughs> I guess. Like the furthest place I've like out of the United States I visited is Mexico. So, are you in or have gone to college? I am in college. I am a junior. Yes, and I am a film major, if you did not know that. Um, what's your worst subject, what was your worst, oh, what was your favorite and worst subject in high school? My favorite subject was math, and my worst subject, no, my favorite subject was English. My worst subject is science. I've always been really bad at science. Number 10, what is your favorite drink? My favorite drink is Shirley Temple, honestly. I mean, you don't have that, like, laying around the house, but if I go to a restaurant, you know to order me a Shirley Temple. Okay, um, number 11, what is your favorite animal? It asked earlier between cats and dogs. I would say dog, but it's really cliche. Outside of like that, like house pets, I would say my favorite animal, hmm, owls. And what is your favorite perfume? I don't really have a favorite perfume, but the my favorite two perfumes I always wear is Daisy by Marc Jacobs. I love that perfume, it smells so good and Very Sexy by Victoria's Secret. You can never go wrong with a Victoria's Secret fragrance. Tea or coffee? <laughs> Asked me this question like a week ago and I would've said coffee. I'm really leaning towards tea. I love tea, you guys. What would you have or have named your children? Oh my God, y'all, my list is so long for what I wanna name my kids them. But I always said I want, if I have, I want three kids and I want two boys and one girl, and I want to name them April, Aiden, and Ash. What sports do you play, have you played? Um, my two sports in high school were competitive cheer, high school cheerleading, and track. Um, but I really did competitive cheer more than any of them. I love cheerleading. I wish I could still do it. Like, that was my thing. Like, that was, I really, y'all, heads on for, like, I, realized what my passion was I wanted to be a cheer coach I wanted to open my own gym like I really I was a passionate cheerleader dude what is your favorite book <gasps> my favorite book is The Giver I have never read The Giver I will link down the little link down below so you can go listen to the audiobook or go get it because it's so good um, what are some of your favorite youtubers okay I have to start off with 
Bethany Moda is my favorite YouTuber. I don't even much watch her as much as I did when I was younger, but she was literally my inspiration for why I wanted to start a channel. Kelsey Simone, Bethany Moda, um, try to think of some more. Sian Lily, um, who else? Um, the Casey Twins, just a lot of them. I love their personalities and they just inspire me to really want to be myself and like just go after what I wanted like I love those youtubers that you can tell just because they have a better lifestyle now that they're still so humble like those are like definitely my favorite YouTube what is your favorite movie my favorite movie is the notebook <laughs> I sound like a little cliche girl but I love the notebook that's a really good movie what is your idea of an ideal first date um I feel like a first date doesn't have to be super extravagant. Going on a picnic and like just getting some fruits and sushi and just like laying out and being able to sit there and talk to each other about like your likes and dislikes. I feel like a first date is all about just pretty much getting to know that person. So like going to a movie or doing something like mini golf, it's kind of hard because you don't get to really talk to that person. I feel like a face-to-face -face experience on a first date is really like... Um, how many boyfriends have you had? If you want to count like real boyfriends, I've only had like maybe like two or three like real relationships. Favorite memory from childhood? Favorite memory from childhood would be when I made the cheerleading squad at my first um, Catholic school because every single body on that team knew how to do a back handspring already. They knew how to do a back tuck, layouts. Like they were like really experienced and no lie, like I had experience from my previous school but it wasn't as intense as them like my toe touches they were on point that's probably what got me on the team but yeah like that was one of my favorite childhood memories um, do you speak any different languages and how well I know a little 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 bit of Spanish and I can kind of understand it um, I would say as speak uh, for speaking a different language I definitely speak pig Latin like fluently like do you have any siblings and how many I have three brothers and I mean three sisters and two brothers how would you describe your fashion sense I had like it depends on the day honestly it really depends on the day I would say in general as a whole I'm like a old school 90s baby vintage look like all of my looks even though they're all kind of different they're always some type of old school like tang to it or something what is your favorite restaurant I don't really have a favorite favorite restaurant but my favorite restaurants to go to are like hibachi I love hibachi what are some of your favorite tv shows right now my particular favorite shows are like all the ones that come on ion so like criminal minds law and order blue blood um burn notice like stuff like that you know PC or Mac, definitely Mac, of course. What phone do you have? Uh, iOS or Droid? I have the iPhone 7 Plus. And uh, tell us um, one of your bad habits. My worst habit is probably overthinking. I overthink everything, y'all. Like, like, I really have a bad habit of overthinking. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed my little answers to the get to know me tag questions. Um, I tried to answer them as best as I could. I love you guys so much. Y'all are so supportive. Y'all are like literally the best friends I've ever had. When it asks me who are my best friends, I really should say you guys. So like I said before, please be on the lookout because I am having a 200 subscribers giveaway very, very soon. I'm really excited about that. Um, but yeah, give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys on Wednesday. I love you guys so much. Mm.